talking to Luma? Yeah. Mom is filming. Should we pause it for a second? Good morning, guys, and welcome to today's vlog. I just got home from my workout class. I didn't go for the past like five days, maybe. I thought it was gonna be like a good class. It's like, okay, I feel good. And then we started off running on the treadmill with 15% incline. It literally just like ruined the whole <laughs> like class for me because it took me so long to like catch my breath. And you know when you run like that and it's at an incline and then it's just like painful, you literally feel like you are going to die. That is how I started off the class. And then I just like could not keep up for the rest of it because I was so dead. I should have started off slow, but that was not the instructions. I'm back home now. I'm making a little yogurt bowl. I have a couple errands I'm gonna run today and I'm gonna go shower and get ready after this. I have some new clothes from Abercrombie. They're sponsoring this video, which I'm so excited about because we shop from them all the time. I really wanted avocado toast, but we do not have bread. What, babe? I think I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's today. I already ordered from two different grocery stores yesterday, but I'm wanting to go there. So later today, Parker's sister, Cassie, her husband, Jared, and their kids are coming over and we're gonna have a little pizza night. Okay, I forgot to get these out. I wanted to put peaches in here, but my peaches are not ripe yet. This is my favorite granola. Very naked maple pecan granola. I'm gonna put honey on top. I'm also gonna heat up my peanut butter and microwave to make it drizzle better. I'm usually a skippy girl, but I'm getting this one from Costco that's like the organic creamy peanut butter that has just dry roasted peanuts and salt. I'm gonna put cinnamon on here. Sometimes I forget the cinnamon, but it's so good. Then the peanut butter. I feel like I'm missing something, but I don't know what it is. I think it's just because I usually have more fruit on this. I also forgot to order hummus yesterday. So I made hummus and I swear homemade hummus is always so much better than store-bought hummus. I don't know why I don't make it more often. Mm, so freaking good. I just Googled homemade hummus and did the first recipe to come up. Here's my breakfast bowl. Now I'm gonna go shower. I'm gonna go eat outside actually. We just got a shade thing. Since we're not moving anymore, we don't have outdoor shade at this house. So I got an umbrella this year and then after we decided to sell our new house, we were like, okay, we need to get outdoor shade. So Parker just ordered like a... I don't know why I can't think of the name, like an awning type thing. It rolls up and then when we want to use it, it just like rolls out and it's so nice. And I don't know why we didn't do that years ago. I think just because we were like, oh, we're going to be moving soon. And then the house kept like getting pushed back and pushed back and pushed back. So we just dealt with it and we had the umbrella from when we needed shade. But now we've been spending so much more time outside now that we have that just because it's so nice to have shade. I got a little water table for the girls. I searched everywhere for like a cute one and I could not find one. But then I actually did find one the other day. So even though we already have one, I'm getting us another one. But it doesn't come until like September. Okay, I just filmed a TikTok of doing my hair. I just put on this outfit, it's from Abercrombie. I'm so excited to be working with them. I love them, we shop from them all the time, especially for Parker, that's like my go-to place to get him a bunch of stuff. I'll show you guys actually what I got for him. His birthday was last month and literally all that I got him was just a bunch of new Abercrombie clothes. He is a clothes man. He just like loves to get clothes for like any holiday or birthday or anything. So my go-to is always just like getting him some new stuff from Abercrombie. So I got him this brown sweater. I've also kind of been like redoing his closet. You guys know that I like to have kind of like a color scheme. Obviously he doesn't have to like follow it and he can pick out and wear whatever he wants, but he has been in his pastel era for the past little while, as have I. And now I kind of am more into just like a neutral minimal look. So Parker's closet has also started to reflect that. And I also want to tell you guys the code before I get too far into this, because they're having a sale. So the the promo code is YouTube AF for 15% off. I'm gonna have Abercrombie linked down below. And then I also picked out this for him. And when I showed it to him, he was like, you already got me that for my birthday. So he now has two of these, but they have cute little like button down shirts. And I love that this is like minimal, but it still has some texture. And then where's the third thing that I got him? 
Mm, I got him something else, but I don't know where it went. I'll move on to my stuff and then see if I can go find those other pieces. But I got two of these tanks for me. You guys know I love a white tank. So I just got this basic one. The high neck is super cute. I also got a gray one. I also got this black swimsuit. So I'll try this on for you guys because I have a couple things to put with it. This is what I'm probably gonna wear today. White tank and then I just have on this cute silky skirt and I was thinking I maybe wanted to put like tennis shoes with it. Okay, this is so cute and fits perfect. It's a little set, it's yellow. And I feel like most of my clothes lately have been literally just like white or cream or gray or maybe like brown or black. So I was trying to find something that was still just kind of like minimal and simple, but was not white. So they had this set, which I think is so cute. It literally fits perfect. I wish this camera was wider. I feel like you guys, wait, is this even zoomed out all the way? Okay, yeah. Next outfit, we have the black bikini. They had a bunch of different styles of like tops and bottoms and stuff. So I picked out this one and then these are the high-waisted bottoms. And then these pants are perfect to literally throw over anything. I should have got like a cute little straw bag or something. They have like accessories and shoes, but this is cute for like beach dinner, pool cover up. I also love this high neckline. I think it's really cute, but I'm gonna take my necklace out. I've been redoing my closet for the past quite a few months now. I'm just trying to like really build up good neutral stain basic pieces so if you're wanting to do that Abercrombie is the perfect place especially if you're wanting some cute fun summer pieces so again link is down below code YouTube AF and that will get you 15% off now what should we do now what time is it it is nap time right now so I think I'm actually gonna go run some errands I need to go three places so I'm gonna get dressed into my other outfit and we are gonna go running errands now and i brought my other camera to switch to because it's a little bit smaller and i oh i turned it on before i left it said full battery and then i just turned it on to film and it's completely dead so switching it to the phone but i just went and got a couple new makeup things i've had my eye on this bronzer forever every time i go in i almost get it but then i don't got this it's a cream bronzer and then i got the brush that goes with it i also need to get like a car tripod or something and then i got a new self tanner the other day still testing it out i don't know how i feel about it but i always love oh i love paradise and i usually get their spray one but i got the foam one and then i also needed to get another one of these like makeup what is this makeup melting butter cleanser i love it so i use this to like take my makeup off and then wash my face it has a little spoon which is nice and then i also got another moisturizer because i go through this one so so fast. That was our first stop. Now, I think I want to go to Ulta next. I've been wanting to get a straightener. I'm pretty sure I got rid of my straightener like semi recently because I never used it, but I want to do like straightener waves and I feel like you need a certain kind of straightener to do straightener waves. I also always get so paranoid that there's someone in the back of my car. Like I always have my back seats down because I don't like to not be able to see back there. My straightener was like not good for straightener waves or straightener curls. So I think I'm gonna go into Ulta. I also need to get hairspray. I was looking at Sephora and they just don't have that many options, so. Finished running errands. I just picked up the pizzas. I also got some groceries, so I'll show you guys what. I got when we get home. I think I've been gone for like three hours. We're just like, where the heck are you? I also just got this Stanley instead of the one with the straw. And it's so much better. I feel like everyone should have this one instead. It is smaller, but I love that the lid like actually closes. I never take my other one out in public anywhere. I'll see people take them like literally to restaurants or like to my workout class. I never do that with my big one because I feel like it just will like spill all over i've also been listening to the thai french podcast on my drive i'm gonna plug this in and listen to that again okay so for the pizzas we usually get just like a large pepperoni one and then my favorite one is the herb chicken mediterranean we usually just do half or the whole thing without chicken depending on who's gonna eat it and then i got garden salad and cheese bread i always have cookie dough but they didn't have it anymore so i don't know if they got rid of it or what but then i got some flowers for the week and i also got sourdough we're gonna try this out usually i go to a grocery store like a local grocery store to get our sourdough but that would be the fourth grocery store that i am going to this week so did not do that but i got raspberries I got some salsa. This is my favorite 
pesto. It's the vegan kale, cashew, and basil pesto. So I got two of those. I also got this green goddess dressing. They had cotton candy grapes, which was so good. I also got this vegan ravioli. So that'll be an easy dinner. Parker wanted some chicken. And then I got these chips, quinoa and black bean. I got this oatmeal. It has a bunch of stuff in it like chia seeds quinoa flax seeds usually i get a bunch of these little like fruit stick things for the girls and then i told them that i was bringing them home a surprise so that's their surprise their first surprise are these little chopstick things but i love this pasta it's brown rice pasta so i usually do this with the pesto and then like a couple different veggies and tofu we've been eating a ton of tofu so i usually have been ordering like in bulk when i order i also got little applesauce packs for the girls apple mango and apple carrot and then these granola bars are so freaking good so that was another one of their little surprises and i also got the 21 seasoning salute because i go through this so fast because i put it on my tofu and then i got more chickpeas i got maple syrup too i also got burrata or burrata i don't even know how to say it but i got this from a different grocery store and i saw a sandwich on pinterest that i want to make so i'll probably stop vlogging for the rest of the day so we can just hang out with the family and then i will show you guys attempting to make my sandwich tomorrow what baby i got you a granola bar did you already have a snack what time is it 4 22 chocolate peanut butter granola bars right maybe they're just peanut butter actually you want some what the here you go. All right, guys, you asked for it. He's back! Yay! We have a cooking with Parker special. Wow. It's not HelloFresh. That is big time. It's this ciabatta bread, but you toast it in the pan. Is this olive oil in here? Yes. Parker just bought like a, like a barbecue it was, chef's yeah, kit. Yeah, it was like one of those like Blackstone kits. So you toast it in the pan. I saw this on TikTok. And then it has Ready? arugula. It has pesto on it. Did it say that? Yeah. Burrata, salt, pepper. I think it's gonna be so good. What's going in the little pan? Pinkies. Oh. Look at that, perfect sear. Next we gotta do some pesto. Wait, 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 this might be expired. Oh no, when? A Five days ago. It's fine, I'm gonna do a hefty amount of this. Parker also saw these on TikTok. They're actually so nice, especially when you oh, have like a kid dude. in your arms and you like don't have two hands to twist the thing. Look how beautiful that is. Ah, oh, look at that. Perfectly sliced, a little bit of salt. What else, what are we missing? Where's the cheese? Right there here. it is. We'll go like this and we'll just break it open. What else? I think it's just more salt and pepper and a little bit of olive oil and we're good. Look at this. This is also very easy. What? For you. It's not easy to I make something that it. amazing. Let's see. Try it, let's see. How is it? Oh, it's actually a little good. I don't know if it would be like too plain. I feel like this bread might be a little too thick. But... No, I think it's perfect. Oh, it's falling apart. I like it. No. Thanks. All right, the next day again, we are back in the kitchen. I'm gonna edit this vlog. It's currently nap time slash quiet time, but we just got back from Target, so I wanna show you guys a couple things that we got. Coco had a gift card, so she got a Paw Patrol toy, literally a huge one. Everything was like on sale, like 70% off or 30% off. So she basically got like literally the biggest thing that they had, but it was really cheap. So uh, that's upstairs, so putting it together. But I got peanut butter checks. I wanted to get this when I ordered groceries this week, but they didn't have it at my grocery store and it sounded so good. So I got it to Target. My Little Pony coloring book, also a coloring thing. Another My Little Pony thing. Parker also is in his cooking era, so he got some croutons. Our neighbors have a garden, so they've been giving us like fresh lettuce and they gave us two or three new bags today. So he was saying he wanted to like make a salad, so he got croutons. Um, I got another thing of nutritional yeast. I go through this so fast. I literally just got one the other day and it's almost gone, but then we needed body wash, a new loofah. Parker got ranch seasoning for his salad he's gonna make. He also needed a dish pods. I needed a little travel face wash, so I got that. And then we got a bunch of mac and cheese, pony mac and cheese, and Paw Patrol. A bunch of those. And then we needed new kids toothpaste and a new Paw Patrol toothbrush, apparently. We were out of powdered sugar, so we got that. Parker must need flour for something else he's going to be cooking because he got a of flour. That's all we got. <laughs> Not super exciting, but I wanted to show you guys before I end the video. Yeah, that's going to be it for this vlog today. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to check out Abercrombie code YouTube AF for 15% off of their website. So that's going to be linked down below if you guys want to shop. But that is it for today. So I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Bye guys.